discuss how to prepare random donor platelets. From the donor, whole blood is collected over 6 to 8 minutes. The amount varies from 450 ml to 350 ml depending on the body weight of the donor. 450 ml of blood put into quadruple bag from which PRVC, FAP and Buffy coat separated. And then from the Buffy coat, RBP and WBCs are separated and collected. This is the quadruple sagum bag. The bags are tied and put inside the centrifuge bucket. Equal weight of the buckets checked in the balancing machine. The blood components are separated in the centrifuge machine. Herein, blood is spun at high speed so that the heavier red blood cells and the plasma are separated. This is the centrifuge chamber. Buckets are placed inside the chamber. Now the machine put into a hard spin centrifugation at 22 degrees centigrade for around 8 minutes. The buckets are removed carefully. without disturbing the sediments. Heavier RBCs settle at the bottom, platelet ring at the center with plasma at the top. The bags are attached to the automatic component extractor. Seals are broken, so to collect the components in three bags. The PRVC and plasma are separated. The remaining part is the Buffy coat platelet concentrate. It is again subjected to light spin centrifugation at 22 degrees centigrade for 6 minutes. Two bags are removed. And the blood bags are attached to the component extractor.
platelets are seen as a white band this is the platelet concentrate now the rtp bag is separated by clamping the heat seal and the buffy coat wbc is discarded rbcs are kept in room temperature for around 1 hour then they are stored in the agitator 350 ml whole blood connected into the triple bag from which prbc and platelet rich plasma separated then rtp and fft collected from it bags are tied and put inside the centrifuge bucket white balance of the buckets done with plastic bars then the blood put into hard spin centrifugation bags are removed placed on expressor which squeezes the bag and thus separates platelet rich plasma from red blood cells After separating, sagam added to the PRBC to increase its shelf life. And PRBC bags are separated. Now the remaining platelet-rich plasma again put inside the centrifuge bucket. for centrifugation it is subjected to light spin centrifugation floaters are the platelets now the bag is placed on expressor which squeezes the bag and separates plasma and platelets remain down these white like floaters are the platelets some plasma are pushed back into the platelet bag to get a volume of around 60 to 90 ml of rdp the main difference is in the quadruple bag rdp it is liquor reduced whereas in the triple bag there is a bit of wbc contamination <laughs>